What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another vlog. Today is, what is today? Today's Tuesday and I just dropped the kids off at school. I just have a bunch of errands to run, things to get done. So I figured I'd pick up the camera and vlog a little bit. I just went through the car wash. So I'm sitting outside. I'm about to vacuum out my car. It is an absolute train wreck. So that is the first order of business get this car cleaned and then I have a chiropractor appointment in a little bit and I need to eat something for breakfast. I'm literally starving. It's 10 15. I don't normally wait this late to eat breakfast, but I just was busy this morning. I've been up since five. I got my workout done at 5 30. I started a 21 day challenge at burn Boot Camp. It's a gym right by my house, which is so convenient. And I'm just trying the 21 day challenge to see how I like it. And so far, I've been obsessed. So today's only day two of the challenge, but I did do a free week trial last week. So this is going on to my second week of burn boot camp, and I'm honestly loving the workouts. I'd love to keep up with it after this 21 days, but it's super expensive every single month and we have literally everything that we need in our home gym. So we'll see more on that later, but for now let's get this car clean. It is such a freaking mess and I cannot move on with my day until this is done. Okay, my car is clean. Went through the car wash or it's pretty clean. I need to like wipe down the seats and all that, but I didn't bring that stuff with me. And then I went to Panera to get some breakfast because it was like awkward timing between my appointment and I just have like 20 minutes to spare. And I pulled in at 10.32 and I ordered this, it looked really good. It was like an egg white avocado spinach breakfast sandwich. And I was like, that's pretty healthy. And I was excited to order it and it was 10.32 and she was like, I'm sorry, we stopped serving breakfast at 10.30 and she wouldn't put my order through. So since it's late, and it's almost lunchtime. I decided I'm just gonna wait and eat lunch after my appointment. I have some really yummy leftovers, so I'll look forward to that. I'm 20 minutes early to my appointment, like I said, and I think I'll just sit here in the car and I might go in a little early and see if they can get me in and maybe just like check my emails because my inbox is out of control. So that's the plan. Okay, I'm home from the chiropractor. I'm gonna eat lunch. I was gonna have leftovers, but I forgot I have one of these meals left and this one is really good. Last week for meals, all week we did eat FitGo and I'm actually, I was planning on going there again today, but to have stuff I can make for dinner tonight or we can just do leftovers. So I think I will hold off and go tomorrow. And then at Costco, I found that our Costco now has Zevias, which we drink all the time, but I've never had this creamy, creamy root beer flavor. So I'm gonna have this with my lunch. I don't know why it's not focusing, but I'm so hungry. So I'm going to pop this in the microwave, eat real quick, and then take Sunny on a walk. It is 1138. So I got two hours till I need to go get Liam and a few more errands I need to run. Oh my gosh, that's so good. These, if you've never heard of Zevias, they're, they taste seriously just like soda. So if you like soda, but you want a healthy alternative, these are so good. They're sweetened with stevia and they taste delicious. Okay, I'm heading out the door, but wanted to show you guys my outfit. By the time this video is up, I will have just posted a Lululemon fall haul. And I got this scuba hoodie and I'm absolutely obsessed. So perfect for fall. I love the color and it's so cute. I'm wearing the extra small small and it fits me perfectly. I'm five foot one, so it hits me at a great length. I'm obsessed. And then these joggers, I just love. I'm they're so good. Just so you can see the waistband, it's nice and thick with a tie. I love it and I thought it was cute with these little new balances, but I'm gonna head out the door, go run a quick errand, maybe get a Starbucks, and then pick up Liam from school. I watch you as you drive do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on, I put my feet up. Okay, I ran into Target because I really needed dry shampoo and I needed stuff for like, I don't know, I didn't grocery shop very well this week. So I needed stuff for like breakfasts and I've been craving breakfast sandwiches. So I got um, English muffins, cheese, I have eggs, and then I got these chicken and maple breakfast sausages. I thought that would be very yummy. I've been watching Jaclyn Hill's like health journey and she posted her first video series yesterday and she had a breakfast sandwich and it looked so good. 
and that's why I've been craving it. And then this is the dry shampoo that I use, the Batiste. It's literally so good and it's so affordable. You've probably heard of it before. And then the other thing I had to do, we have major shoe drama in our house. Every single morning before every single dance class, every pair of shoes bugs Maddie. And the only thing that she likes are Crocs. And this morning it was cold out and I was like, you cannot wear Crocs to school. She had this huge meltdown over wearing Nikes to school. So being the nice mom that I am, I went and got her fur lined Crocs. <laughs> they only had white, which I'm hoping they don't get filthy, filthy, dirty, but I actually kind of like that they're white because then they'll go with everything. And then of course I had to get her some charms for her shoes, which I feel like I'm missing one. I'm gonna be mad if it's left there. Stupid things are like $4. <laughs> Maybe it's in this box somewhere. I'll check later when I get home. And then Liam, we had shoe drama this morning because the stinking dog chewed off the entire Velcro strap to his Nikes. Love that for me. So $120 later, I had to buy new shoes today. Got him these little Adidas. He's easy. He could care less what goes on his feet. The coffee. I went to get the pumpkin cold foam or whatever it's called and they didn't have that. That's okay. I ended up getting just an iced coffee and that's healthier. Anyway. Okay. Off to pick up Liam. I will see you guys when I go. Okay, I just spent the last literally hour of my life trying to make a TikTok try on haul of the Lululemon stuff I posted. Let me just show you guys. It's not even good. <laughs> I need some serious help with the transitions, but I was already so deep into it and I'd already spent so much time on it. I was like, I'm just going to post this. So we have about 15 minutes till we need to go pick up Maddie. And then she has dance from five to 6.30. There's like a, we have this mom's club in our neighborhood. We live in a pretty big neighborhood and I recently joined the mom's club and they have a lot of really fun events. So if you follow me on Instagram, you saw last weekend, we went to like a white party where we all dressed in white and had like just drinks and food. It was super fun. And tonight there's a boutique that has like a truck, like a, like a food truck, but a boutique on wheels, I guess and they're doing like cocktails and shopping at the boutique. So I'm gonna try to hit that up on the way home, especially since we're just gonna heat up leftovers for dinner. I figure I could stop Maddie and check out what they have. I think they have a lot of really cute Chiefs gear that I wanna look at. So that's the plan for the rest of the night, but. What's up you guys? All right, it's the next day. Last night, just we were super busy and like, you know, I just didn't even have time to pull out my camera. Um, but I basically took Maddie to dance and sat there for an hour and a half while that was going on and then Maddie and I went to that, um, I think I told you guys, I was going to a little neighborhood mom's club event and they had a ton of Chiefs stuff. We live in Kansas City, if you're new here, and we are definitely Chiefs fans. My mom makes fun of us here in Kansas City because she swears the only thing that people wear here is like Kansas City stuff. Actually, I'll show you guys what I got because it is so cute, hang on. Okay, so if you are local, this store is called Love Letters, shoploveletters.com is their website. And here's the t-shirt that I got. I thought it was so fun. Okay, so here's the t-shirt that I got. How fun is that? Uh, definitely gonna wear that to the game on Sunday. And then I also got this crew neck that I'm obsessed with and they had it in toddler sizes. So obviously Maddie got one too. How cute, you guys. I, I got a size small in both of these. The t-shirt fits great. I kind of wish I got a medium in this just for like a super oversized look, but it's still, I mean, it fits me perfectly. So super, super cute. Thought I would share that with you guys. Here's their info if you want to screenshot this or whatever and look them up on their social. It was such a cute little idea. I don't know. I loved it. So obsessed with this. Can't wait to wear it. Check them out if you're local, so, so good. Okay, so back in my office area, I am working on some little fall designs for my um, for my little small shop, and I wanna do some like Halloween kind of fall t-shirts and all that. So working on that, I was gonna try to crank out two designs today while the kids are at school. I just dropped Liam off. Maddie got on the bus earlier this morning around 8.30 got myself a coffee. I'm gonna get to working on this. I don't have too much to do today, which is great. I scheduled a workout for 5.30 p.m. And what else? I need to go return Maddie's Crocs because they're too big. That's what's going on over here today. Welcome back to the vlog. Um, yeah, let's see what we get into today. I 
tell that something's off the way you look and how you Okay, I'm about to take Sunny on a walk, but I just made these for my small shop. I think they turned out so cute. I'm totally wearing this on Halloween, and I totally am wearing this to go to the pumpkin patch with the kids with like a flannel tied around my waist. If you guys are wanting to order one of these, just send me a DM on my small shop's Instagram. It's Soulshine Design Co., and I can get that made for you guys. Um, but yeah, I will leave that linked down below if you want to check it out. Do you want to go on a walk? Do you want to go on a walk? Huh? Where's your leash? Where is it? Okay, I successfully got Maddie's shoes exchanged, so hopefully those will work out. She was very excited about them, but they were a little bit too big. I She's six years old, and she's only in a size nine shoe, which I feel like she has such small feet. I feel like most of her friends are in like a 13 or something. Anyways, I got that and then I went into Target and I needed, I threw away my nail clippers when I was cleaning out my bathroom because they were just kind of gross and I desperately need to cut my nails. I hate when my nails get long and I just spent like $100 on a manicure and pedicure the other day and I swear it lasted two seconds. So I saw these while I was in there. They're like nail strips and they say they last up to 14 days and I thought we could try that today on the vlog. So I'm gonna try those when I get home. I think that'll be fun. And I also picked up some snacks because I'm starving. These are my absolute favorite. There's some lady next to me staring at me, probably thinking I'm such a weirdo, but that's fine, I'll never see her again. And I got a veggie wrap from Target. Kind of random, but I was like, wait, I haven't had lunch and I'm starving. When you talk, I think you said enough You said you love for me something brand new You said this is something you would never do Here we are in your car, let me say who you are Who you really are, are yeah Don't need you here to say you're sorry Cause if you're gonna leave me then Okay, update. I put the nails on and I forgot to show you guys, but I peeled them off almost immediately. They bugged me so bad because it literally feels like stickers on your nails. Like you can just peel them off. Definitely don't waste your money on those is what I'm trying to say. But I think Liam and I are gonna go play outside. Sissy gets off the bus in like a half an hour. So we're just gonna go chill outside and get some vitamin D. Okay, we decorated the Crocs. How cute. I mean, is it weird that I kind of want some in my size? No. Should we be twins? Yes. <laughs> I feel like these would be so comfortable. They are. Oh my gosh, feel so it, cute. The inside. Okay, home from my workout. My face is bright red. That was so hard. I cannot get over how hard these workouts are. They're not getting easier. They are still so hard. I'm so sore every single day. Today was cardio. I don't know what's going on with my hair, whatever. Um, today was cardio. It was like six exercises, two minutes at each station, and we went through it twice. And it doesn't sound like a lot, but the exercises were so hard. Like we did battle ropes and then you had to army, or not army crawl, bear crawl to and there and back. And then there was one where he had to flip this big like boxing bag, flip it, and then hop over it, turn around and keep doing that for two minutes. Med ball slams. Oh my gosh, it was just so hard. If you're gonna leave me, then just do it. Ooh. than me that can make you feel the way you feel when I hold you I think I said enough you said you love for me something brand new you said this is something you would never do here we are in a car let me say who you are who you really are yeah don't need you here to say you're sorry
Up. I'm about to do my skincare. I just took a shower and crawl into bed and watch some TV. There's literally nothing better than going to bed with a completely clean house because then you wake up with no chores to do immediately. That is something I do pretty much 99% of the time is pick up the house, clean the kitchen, make sure all the dishes are put away, the dishwasher is running, all that good stuff, and then I get ready for bed. Um, that way when I wake up in the morning, I can wake up in a better mood knowing I don't have a disaster kitchen to clean or laundry to fold and stuff like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare and call it a night, but that's gonna be it for the few days in my life. I hope you enjoyed the vlog, and if you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and join the YouTube family, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.